The Salvation Army gave out over 4 million pounds of food last year. Right now, they're overflowing with food they want families to have. Esther Bauer shows us how to keep your hands on or how to get your hands on some help. Right now, there's a surplus of food here at the Salvation Army Food Bank. Any family can come in and shop these shelves for whatever items they may need. If you need any food help, please come see the Salvation Army. To score all types of food free of charge. Inflation's jumped at its fastest pace in nearly 40 years, piling pressure on families to make ends meet. In this past year, the price of groceries have really skyrocketed, and so that's really hitting families in a very negative way. So the Salvation Army wants to help families have a positive start to the year. We just want to encourage folks that they need any type of food right now to come by, see the Salvation Army, save their um, money to pay their rent and their utility bill, but get your groceries from us. They're also in need of volunteers to move food from the warehouse to these shelves. You can become a long-term volunteer or just stop by for for a few hours to restock food, so families have lots of options when they shop. We really need volunteers to help uh, stock the shelves and help our guests walk through and go shopping. They're brimming with non-perishables. Pallets of rice and uh, canned goods and cereals. But could use more protein and meats in the freezer. You don't need any identification to visit the food bank and are free to shop for whatever your family needs the most. And you're going to want to mark this date down in your calendar. The Salvation Army is closed tomorrow, so this food bank will reopen Tuesday, January 18th. Reporting from the Salvation Army this evening, Esther Bauer, 4 News Now.